All right, and it's about that time. I haven't had a break of ones in a while, so I'm going to look through for any of the star notes, uh, some broken ladders, repeaters, radar notes, uh, some low serial numbers. So <clears throat> any, especially any bank notes and uh, stuff like that. So anyhow, but if you want to look up your notes, make sure to go to mycurrencycollection.com. <clears throat> It'll walk you through on running through your serial, your, your star notes, your serial number, your cool serial numbers, um, the more rarities and stuff like that. The older the notes, uh, if they're older, I want to say but pre-1992, you'll probably have to look those up separately because the My Currency Collection, I want to say, only started back in 1992. So anyhow, these two wraps right here were actually in the uh, teller's drawer and then as you see right here the bank wrap ones they've got its own little wrapping around it so i'm probably going to go ahead and start with these which it doesn't matter because we're going to go through them all anyways see if we can get anything one stack down and we did get one star note out of there so that will be the first one here we'll go ahead and jump into the second teller wrap and work on it strap number two two more <clears throat> star notes so pull them over here number three all right we got number three down we got one more star note in there <clears throat> sorry I keep clearing my throat <clears> i'm <throat> working outside all the time and i'm breathing in all the cow manure and dust and so forth so on being out that i'm on the pipeline all day long anyhow let's run over to this next one <clears throat> Now, we didn't have anything in the fourth stack, but this was the fifth stack that I pulled off. We had three star notes in here also. So, let's see, it's 2017, 2013, 2013. Yep. All right, uh, pull these over here. And grab number six. All right, the sixth wrap, we got one more. So it's another 2013. Number seven. So the seventh stack, we got another star note. So <clears throat> I want to say whenever they say, whenever they show you have a B at the beginning and a star at the end, that if you go to look up your this star note, that's a 2009. So if you go and look up this star note, it might pop up. I'll look at it here shortly at the end of the video, but it might pop up that there's an actual duplicate of this bill. So there's an actual duplicate serial number out there. So I want to say it actually starts with a B and ends with a star there. So if all possible, if I go in, I put this information in and it gives me that information, the star note here might be worth a, only, you know, a couple bucks. Right now it looks like it's only worth 60 cents the way it looks. But if you go in, if you're able to find the duplicate note that this comes in, they say they're actually worth several hundred dollars up to thousands of dollars uh in better condition you know if you got a <clears throat> higher grade on these star notes here for with the b and you also have the other b note that's the same serial number and it's a higher grade supposedly worth a, a lot of money for them but anyhow so that's the seventh stack there got another star note let's move on to number eight strap number nine gave us two more star notes i honestly haven't found any broken ladders or birthday notes or any repeaters or radars or anything nothing has actually been really close it's been quite far off anyhow last strap all right we didn't get anything from uh strap number 10 so i'm gonna go ahead and set all of these up over here and <clears throat> going to work through and look in all of the serial numbers here with the star notes see if you have anything special so but i'll bring you back in for that well we didn't have anything rare or uncommon everything was pretty common <clears throat> run prints were usually around three million to eight million in run print uh we had several of the 2013s here the 2017s and then that one 2009 b star note there so anyhow it's worth the check. It's worth going up there, like I said, get some cash, double check through and see if there's anything to take out. Like I said, collector standpoint is pretty nice. It's awesome that I'm able to get into the bill search now. But anyhow, like the video, please give it a thumbs up and y'all have a great day.